Casting often asks for a full body slate for a myriad of reasons. I work in the commercial casting world, and so for us, the full body is important because we might be casting a family, so we wanna make sure that we have all shapes and sizes of that family. Maybe we're casting a spot that has a famous basketball player, and that basketball player is seven feet, two inches, so we're looking for height in the slates because we want our hero to be the focal point, and so we're looking for actors who are gonna be shorter than our hero, so the hero can be the focal point. So how to do a full body slate the way that I like them done is I like for the actor to state their name, their location, and their height. I like them to be framed from like the chest up with very little space between the top of their head and the top of the frame. Why? Because then that makes you the focal point. Make sure that you're framing that part of your slate horizontally. Then what you want to do is in the editing phase of your full body slate, you want to put those together in the same clip. The reason I, I like it like, like that is because, again, it gives me an overall view of who you are horizontally, right? You're the focal point, and then I get to see the shape of your body and the height. Another suggestion that I have is when you're saying your name, location, and your height, don't have that vertical part of you, that vertical uh, slate the full body pop up until you say your height. So for example, if you can see in my example here, you see where I'm horizontal. Once I say my name, my location, as soon as I say my height, that's when my vertical portion of my full body slate pops up. I just prefer it that way. There's a lot of different ways. There's no right or wrong way, I should say. But for me as a casting director, that's what I prefer because it allows me like two to three seconds to really focus in on you because you're, you're tightly framed. And then when you say your height, that's when I get to see the full body. So I'm not really distracted by those two images at once. Overall, in the full body slate, uh, another thing that I want you to pay attention to is when you're slating your name. Uh, you don't want it to be robotic, like, hi, I'm Melanie Mack. I don't talk like that in the real world, uh, so I'm not going to talk like that in my slate. I would say, hi, I'm Melanie Mack. Right, it also gives us on the casting side a sense of your personality. For commercials, a lot, of, a lot of the reason that we book you is based on your, your personality, based on if you can execute direction in the callback room, based on if you're a good storyteller and you're really specific in the relationships that you've created in your self-tape audition. So for that full body slate, those are the things that I would pay attention to. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, go ahead and click this button right here for a lot of other tips from the casting side when it comes to virtual and self-tape auditions. Okay. Okay, I will see you in my next video.